You gotta open this video. Uh, say hey guys, welcome back. You have to. No. Oh my word. What all have you got done so far? Well. I, I know you've scrubbed everything, right? No, the windows. In, the windows. We got that yellow. Yeah, they needed when they look good. I said that. We well, didn't get the outside because they're going to power wash the house. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, this will come down yeah. later. We just got to keep it up there for a lot for now. She hates ceiling fans, don't she? Everybody loves ceiling fans. I like I ceiling like fans them. too. Well, you're the only one I know. I know. I like mine. Anyway. Well, of course, you know, they painted the ceilings, uh, they had to kill some. Uh, yeah, but of course, you can already know Billy. He took the strips down and filled yeah, those in. And then that room's been painted, and the floor, the floor is the floor is still done. We still like the floor. The floor, the floor, the floor too. Of course, just been scrubbing dirt out today. Got the tub and showered the dirt out. Uh -huh. see, you know. Yeah, that's cool. Well, I told her, I said, those windows look really good, like they're in good shape. So that's huge oh, yeah, that you don't have to replace a the window. Place. They look good. Okay. So this is Shonda's mom. Oh. What's your name? Mom, Shonda's mom. Shonda's mom. Been, <laughs> how about they have been here since before 8 o'clock? <laughs> I look horrible. You uh, do not. You do not. This, <laughs> Shonda's mom, Lynn. Yeah. Shonda's mom yeah, is getting it done. Huh? Yeah, there's one in the bottom of my bag. Um. Okay, Shonda. We love it. Truck load of garbage. <laughs> Made it pick out. This is a nice place. It will be. It's big. This is Miss Daisy. Daisy, Waylon's girlfriend. Uh, so do you want to do the same, like just wallpaper from one point up? How tall do you want the board and bat and so I'll know where to start? About right there. That's good. But whatever you think. I think that's perfect. Whatever. Just be honest. You want me to be honest I don't want to be able to take that. Put that up. Leave it again. <laughs> I'm leaving it. <laughs> okay, so being the amazing organized, having all my ish together YouTuber, I forgot my tripod at home. So y'all just gonna hang out in the sink and tool it and window seal and just wherever I can find a sweat to boot you. Then when you start spraying stuff. Do not swallow. Do not get on skin or I can't drink it. Avoid contact with eyes. I wanted to drink it so bad. Is there a paper somewhere? Yeah, I wonder. <laughs> this is why I'm here. She don't read directions. This. We could put a body in that and bury it. No. Four sixty nine. No. I think they're expensive. Is that a grill? I don't. Know. Oh my god. It's forty two dollars. The bug feeder. Oh shoot. So I need okay. an overall plate. Paint. We need $2. It ain't even a bird figure. I ain't ever filmed the whole outside of it. For the first time in ages, I wake up and don't hate it. I guess I found some peace. Through the day to the evening, without shouting and screaming, something new to me. When we got here, Shonda's mom had already like cleaned the windows and walls and just done a whole lot. So that saved us so much time. So these windows still hadn't been cleaned. Heather jumped in, was helping Shonda and everybody clean windows. And then we had Waylon and his girlfriend priming the walls. And then Shonda took over and was putting primer on the walls. And there were so many people here and we were all just jumping in, doing as much as we could, as quick as we could. And I feel like we got so much accomplished. Shonda is so blessed to have the people that she does that will jump in and help her do things like this. And it's moving along pretty quickly. You'll see in a few minutes how much we get done, but I think it's looking good. It's looking really good. Her dad had already done the flooring and Heather jumped in and worked on the kitchen cabinets. I worked in the bathroom and in the master and we just had several people in each room and we were getting it done.
Shauna and I went to Ace Hardware and we were getting some paint mixed for the bedroom and we were like, I wonder if we could just spray paint that vanity in the bathroom. So it's ultra matte. I'm not sure the color. I'll have to get the color and let you guys know. But we are painting the walls. We're putting new flooring down, all that. So it didn't matter if there was like, you know, spray paint on the floor or anything like that. But we spray painted this vanity and it turns out so good and I even wiped it down like after I got the cabinet doors hung today I took a damp cloth and I wiped them down but I really think spraying is the way to go and her dad has a paint sprayer that he's never used so we may just have to break that out because that is so much quicker and so much easier especially with cabinet doors Got something every good thing comes to an end at least it always happened to me i'm telling you this now you don't need to worry because i got this all down 
So this that my brother is going around spraying the trim with is a primer and a spray paint. And it is for wood colored trim or stained wood. The guys at Ace Hardware, they were showing us this and they said that it worked really well. It would be so much better than just the kilts. So that is what he's spraying there and it covered so, so good. And so much easier than just going around that border with a paintbrush. There was some yellowing on like the white doors and you all seen that tub and just some different things. Even the windows, when we cleaned the windows, there was some yellow on it. And whoever lived here before, I think smoked in the house and we washed of course all the windows they wash these doors twice so we put primer on those and you can see the difference there and the white and the yellow and now when you walk in this house you cannot smell smoke at all so it's crazy how just a fresh coat of paint and just cleaning will take care of the smoke smell shonda also painted all of the ceilings throughout the house and those were yellow too I didn't see the before, but around the light fixture in the bathroom, you can see where she painted and it is a huge difference. So you see above the door, there are vents there and she took those down and she's replacing those. She's going to replace all the vents throughout the house. She's replacing all of the appliances. She's buying new appliances. So it's going to be a really nice place when she gets done with it. Okay guys, so the doors came down. I was so excited to see these go. I actually told her because she wanted to keep them so bad. And I was like, well, why don't you just keep them and leave them open? Like prop them open with something. She was like, no, let's just take them down. So she took them down and I think she's gonna trim it out in wood, maybe faux wood beams around that or something, but we'll make it look nice. But those doors just wasn't it for me. And I know a lot of you liked them, a lot of you didn't. I just didn't think they made a whole lot of sense there. So I ended up spraying around the bathtub on the outside and on the inside I used the bathtub paint kit and if you use this, wear a mask because I have been breathing paint fumes for days. It seems like I can still smell it so it's just like up in my nose or something but it was really strong and it didn't really hit me until I got to one point that I was painting like the very bottom of the tub and then just a big like burst of the smell hit me and I was like oh my gosh I felt like I was gonna pass out I got dizzy so wear a mask I really should have wore a mask we had a fan in there and we had the windows open and we had the fan sucking the air out so the fumes didn't last long in here but they were extremely strong but this bathtub looks so good. It looks so much better. I know what you've been down thinking about him again. I know that your heart's been broken. You should try and let it go 
and start being yourself. You, you. You can put on your dress. We can play your favorite song. And I will take care of you, care of you, care of you. This is what we need. This is what we have to do. Tell me, can you feel it too, feel it too? Maybe you should go away. You don't need to be ashamed Everyone's got their hearts broken sometime Let's go out and lose our minds Forget all about him So this was the next day and where Shonda lives and where this house is, there is not a Lowe's or Home Depot. There is only an Ace Hardware. So Heather and I ran to Lowe's and Home Depot on this morning before we came over and we bought light fixtures for the bathroom, two for the bathroom, and then one for the bedroom. And we picked up just a few things that she needed. So she wanted to board and batten this wall and she wanted the batten strips to be four feet tall. So. I was wanting to take all of these strips down so the wallpaper on top would be smooth. There wouldn't be a piece of trim up under it or those little strips. So I removed those. My brother took all the strips down throughout the house and he was filling those in and he was so over it. So when I took these strips down, I measured between the first two and I was like, okay, that's 24 inches and we can do that. We can go out 24 inches and if it hits this next strip, then we're in good shape. So we measured it out and it was perfect. So we spaced these batten strips out 24 inches apart and the strips covered the seams from where I removed those little strips and he didn't have to do any filling. So he was really excited about that. And then the wallpaper on top is really thick. So it covers those places where I removed those strips. So we didn't need to fill anything in there, but Alden was cutting these strips for me and getting all this batten stuff ready to go. I was so thankful that he was here helping too. Of course, Heather was. But my brother and Alden are pretty close and they have a really good relationship and Alden would do anything for him. He would do anything for Alden. Alden even took a vacation day today to go over and help me work on this house all day long. So I was really thankful that he gave us his time because he's very useful when it comes to cutting things and helping me figure things out in my head. I can tell him what I'm thinking and he can put it all together for me or help me make sense of it. Tell me how to do it. He'll use a saw or spray paint for me. He'll do whatever. It's kind of an odd feeling because used to I was the one like handing him something and you know just kind of being his assistant and now that I've started YouTube and we've done some stuff like this. I've learned to use tools and I've learned how to do a few things. So he is really proud of me. It's really hard for him to step back and just let me do it, but I am very appreciative for his help. And there's so many times that I ask him what his opinion is and he'll tell me how to do something. We have laughed so hard because one of you guys said, don't listen to his ideas, they were terrible. And we have gave him the hardest time about that. We have laughed so much about that, but he is a good sport about it. He thought it was funny too. Anyway, she's doing some board and batten on the bottom and then wallpaper on top.
wandering and fading I know there is something more than this I think I am ready for doing some changing Oh God, there is something With everybody jumping in and cleaning and sanding and filling and priming and painting and laying floors and trim and we got the old appliances out, someone came and picked those up and just so many hands that this project has went really fast. I mean, this is like two days. So I went over there today and I've got all that filmed and I'll throw all that together for you guys to see. And we got a lot done today too. So it's just moving along so quickly and I'm really excited to see. It's fun. It's really fun just to hang out, see all the progress and see what this place is turning into. I think everyone's doing an amazing job. We have the best people around us and Shonda has the best mom and dad, son, her son's girlfriend, and then of course us, you know, we're the best too. So I'm just kidding. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to throw this up and get to editing on what I did today. And I'll have that up for you as soon as I can. Remember, I love you. Jesus loves you. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Fire burning in the night. Be a home for a world so broken. Be a friend to the Show me, make the broken things new.